Life is old there, older than the trees, younger than the mountain, blowing like a breeze. Country road, take me home to the place I belong. <laughs> Recently, I sold my Tesla, and I was so excited because I got paid in all cash. But after looking at the money long and hard, I started to realize it doesn't look very real. I was losing all hope. But that's when I remembered a trick to see if money is actually real or not. This is a real $100 bill, and this is a hundred I got for selling my Tesla. I got a toothpick and tried to put it under the blue part of the $100 Hold bill. On. Let me let me try another one. Okay. Oh, no, no, no. And now time to try the 100% real bill. And for the moment of truth, Oh my gosh, it's working! Oh no, it worked! That means all this money's fake! Subscribe to make me feel better. Hey, think fast. Oh, I feel so bad for you. Why? I'm the bully here. He should be afraid. Whatever you say. Hey, quiet loser. You know what? I'm tired of you being quiet. Are you ready to scream? Are you ready? I'm ready to beat your ass. No, I meant, are you ready to scream? Oh, great heavens! What's your problem? I'm too smart for the first grade. My sister's in grade three, and I'm smarter than her, too. Well, then let's go see what the principal has to say. Okay. How about I give him a test, and if he fails just one question, he has to go back to class and be quiet. Okay, what's three times three? Nine. Six times six? Thirty-six. I see no reason why he can't go to the third grade. He answered all my questions right. Can I ask him some questions? Of course, go ahead. What does a cow have four of that I only have two of? Legs. What do you have in your pants that I don't have? Pockets. What does a dog do that a man steps into? Pants. What starts with F and ends with K? Fire truck. Put him in the sixth grade. I got the last four questions wrong myself. <gasps> this is my roommate Zong and he loves expensive stuff and he will always pick the expensive thing over the cheap thing. So today, I'm gonna trick him. I got a $1 watermelon and a $1,000 watermelon, but it's actually the same watermelon. Let's go trick him. All right, Zong, one of them is cheap, one of them is expensive. Let me know what you think. Okay, I'm gonna try this one, okay? Oh, this one's so sweet. How much is one? $1. $1, never mind. Let me try this one. Ah, this one's kind of sour. How much is one? Thousand dollars. Thousand dollars. You know what? Can I please buy it off you? All right, I'll sell it to you for five hundred dollars. How about that? Okay, that's a good deal to me. Here's the money. Thank I'll you, take brother. this one. The cheap one is so bad. Yeah. <laughs> Today I got the best news ever. So YouTube gives creators a diamond play button once they reach ten million subscribers, and I never received mine. Bruh. But I just saw YouTube announced a twenty million play button, and I want to be the first to get it. I made a promise to myself to reach twenty million subscribers within the next month, or I have to get a tattoo of my biggest hater's name, Vesh Remy, on me. So I ran outside with a sign that would definitely get people to subscribe. Hey, dude, I didn't do anything. That didn't go over so well. <laughs> Moving on to my next idea. I got three moving billboards to go all around town to convince people, but the subscriber growth was still slow. So I had to take things up a notch. I rented an airplane to fly over the city in front of millions of people that said, subscribe to Top Guild. And within seconds, it was already working. Are you guys gonna subscribe? Sure. Yeah! Subscribe to help me get the 20 million play button. What? You're supposed to be sleeping. You have school tomorrow. I can't fall asleep. There's something in my closet. What do you mean? Of course there's stuff in your closet. That's what it's meant for. No, I mean something big, giant, ugly, hairy, and scary. <sighs> Fine. Let me check. Listen. <gasps> oh, McDonald's! Wait, stop, stop. Wait, why? Photos first. 
Okay. Okay, done. Finally. Stop, those photos were for my mom. Now I'm gonna take photos for my friends. We what now? Finally got paid. Woo, I need 100 for nails, 100 for food, and 100 for clothes. We only have a dollar left. Oh, I'll take that one too. Wait, what? Okay, here you go. My phone now. Wait, what? Are you serious? All right, Tom, I'll make you a deal. If everyone watching subscribes, I'll give you your phone back. Please, guys. Is it possible to draw the perfect dotted line? Probably not. But I'm not gonna stop until my dotted lines look exactly like this. First, this is what my dotted lines looked like. A noodle. Just like it's impossible to draw a perfect dotted line, Bruh. it's impossible to like and subscribe at the same time. After trying every possible way to draw a dotted line, and I mean every way, Bruh. it still wasn't perfect. Perfect. So I had to do my research and found out it's the grip. You have to arch your wrists at the perfect angle and go straight down with just the right amount of pressure. No way! I was so close. Before I master my perfect dotted line, I had to challenge my friends. So I told them the secret. Shutters tried. What was that? Tori tried. Oh, it has to be dotted. Brandon oh, tried. That was pretty good. That was smart. And finally. Joe got it! Subscribe if you thought this would be impossible. Hey class, do you know that everyone has secrets? Even our parents? Yes, of course. After school. Mommy! Yes, sweetie? I know your secret. Here's some money, don't tell your dad. Dad, I know your secret. Here's some money, don't tell mom. Uncle Fred, I know your secret. Your mom finally told you? Told me what? That I'm your real dad. Oh, great heavens! Hey Luke, what's your computer password? It's Luke1234. Thank you. But wait, since you know my password now, what's yours? Oh, mine is Superman, Batman, Flash, Iron Man, Loki, Thor, Deadpool, Spider-Man. Why is it so long? Because it said it had to be at least eight characters. Listen. Ah. Left or right? All right? You have to take me shopping! What? Here's your new clothes, go try it on! Ta-da! Oh, your new outfit is so cute, guys. Wait, her new outfit, one to ten. You okay? Yeah. Left or right? Yeah. Oh, we have to go see a shark. Yeah. Oh, I'm so scared. All right, cat, open your eyes. Wait, Tom, I thought you were going to show me a real shark. I would never show you a real shark. I'm scared too. Aww. Yo, Nick, oh. left or right? Mm, what? Oh, today's your lucky day because I got you a brand new car. Oh, Yo, dude, this is so sick. What? Dude, this might be the best gift I've actually gotten in a long time. Like, I no! Yo, cat, left or right? Uh, right. Oh no, you have to throw away all your clothes? What? No, Zong, I don't want to throw them away. All right, cat, if everyone watches subscribed, I'll let you keep them. Guys, please. So you guys saw that last video? I paid Vesh Remy $10,000 to reveal his face, and he didn't do it. So I came up with the perfect plan to reveal his identity once and for all. Step one, getting the right disguise. Vesh Remy is a master of disguise, so I needed something he couldn't possibly recognize me in. Step two, finding Vesh Remy. I found him at the park and spied on him. I waited for the perfect moment to make my move and grab his mask, but my timing was slightly off. My next attempt was an even closer call, but still no identity revealed. Field. After a full day of failure, I was exhausted, but not ready to give up. I used my high-tech binoculars in order to spot him. And once I did, I followed him all day until I saw my perfect moment to act. And then, Vesh Remy gave me the perfect opportunity. I knew this was the moment we had all been waiting for. I went at him with all my power. It was time to reveal the true identity of Vesh Remy. But then... Oh, thanks, Goofball. Subscribe if I should try again. Hey baby, hey, we need to talk. Talk about what? How can I say this? You're just too nerdy, skinny, and just not good looking anymore. I'm breaking up with you. No, please don't. Bye. Ten years later. Hey. Hello? Yeah. I thought you were cute. Can I have your number? Nah, I'm good. What? Do you not know who I am? Do you know who I am? Who? Mr. Nerdy Skinny, just not good looking anymore. George Lopez. Here. Okay. Scotty Turner? Yep. Okay. Logan Smith? Here. Wait. Smith. 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 Do you have an older brother? Yeah. You do? What's his name? Jeffrey. Jeffrey. Jeffrey Smith. That's your brother. Mm-hmm. <sighs> he was a bad kid. Always in detention. Never finished his work. Always late to class. 
Don't tell me you're like him. Are you like him? Uh, no. All right, don't worry. We're gonna have a fun year. How's he doing though? He's doing fine. That's good to hear. Okay, uh... Become Superman or become a mummy? Um, become a mummy. Oh. Mummy time! What? All done. Um, what now? Now, I eat your chips. Wait, no, please! No! You know I can't move! No! No! Kitchen or toilet? Um, kitchen, of course, that's where the food is. So, where's the food? Food? You're doing the dishes, man. What? Doggy! Dog game or cat game? Ooh, um, dog game, dog game. I thought you like cats. If you save the dog, you get $100. Ooh, okay, 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 okay. Oh, ooh, come ooh, on. Ooh, ooh, ooh. No! The dog! Uh, food or money? You know, I gotta go with the food, baby. What am I doing here? You have to throw away your food. Wait, what? Please, no, 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 please. All right, fine. If everyone watching subscribes, you can keep it. Please, guys. Today, I am going to the worst rated restaurant in my city. My goal is to leave a five-star review for this one-star restaurant. But the only rule is, I can't lie. Seeing the one-star reviews online or the police helicopter circling the building, it was safe to say, I think this might be my hardest challenge yet. Walking in, I thought this place didn't look so bad. They even had a chair to hold the door for new customers. Oh. Oh, how polite. Bruh. I was then seated and asked for a Coke, but they brought me a water. However, Coke is unhealthy. So they were just looking out for me. One star. It was now time for some food. They had pizza, sushi, roast chicken, but I decided to go with a simple meal. My utensils didn't really work, but I guess eating with my hands is more fun. This tastes exactly like my lunch from school. Definitely a star. And finally, I went to the bathroom and it was decorated with fine art all over the walls, which gives this place total character and charm. So, uh, star, time to get out of here. The best star of them all was meeting all my fans. Subscribe if I deserve a star. Good morning, class. I hope everyone's ready for what we're gonna do today. What? Do we have a test today? Nah, I don't think so. Oh, thank goodness. All right, so I want everyone to say what their favorite animal is. Oh, that's easy. Um, the desert eagle. I just want to go home. I want to go to my mommy. Which one? Guys, I don't know what to do. Oh, great heavens! Mom, this new show just came out on Disney Plus and it looks so good! We don't have Disney Plus. I know. Can we get it, please? No, we already have Netflix, Amazon Prime, and whatever else we have. We don't need another. <sighs> I knew you would say that. It says there's a seven day free trial. Can we get that? If it's free, then go ahead, but you're not getting my credit card. Yes! Ride a cow, baby! Hoo ya! Come on, Zong! Oh. Oh. Food or love? Um, food, because food is love! Wait, what about me? Uh... Dog or chicken? Ooh, I want a baby chicken! What did he say? Hey. Oh. This chicken is so boring! Why don't you turn it on? Okay! What? It lights up! Gold or diamond? Um, diamond! Yeah. Enjoy the diamond! Thank you guys so much for 10 million subscribers! Song, what's the wall behind you? Oh, if you subscribe, I'll write your name on the wall! We are not friends anymore, bro! I never want to see you again! What do you mean? Way too far! What? So Topper Guild has been calling me his biggest hater, but I actually think the kid likes me. So today I'm gonna see if he thinks we're friends or if he hates my guts by faking my own death and making Topper Guild cry like a baby. First, I wrote out my brilliant plan and got a casket to sell it. <laughs> Is this Best Remy's mask? Wait, 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 why are you giving this? He just passed away. He passed away? Here's the address for the funeral. Oh my gosh. Fesh, Fesh, Fesh Remy, Fesh, no. You know, Fesh, I know we've had our differences in the past, and I know I've called you my biggest hater, but buddy, I, I just want you to know that, that every single time I called you that, I, I didn't really mean it. <laughs> got you, no. baby. Well, I got what I wanted. Wait, what was it? My plan was behind you the whole time, bro. Are you blind? Bro. Get casket, convince everyone I'm dead. Make me cry, but why? Because I wanted to see if we were still friends. You couldn't have just texted me? Thanks, Uncle, for buying me this lottery ticket. No problem. Just remember what you said you'll do in return later. I know, I know. That's tomorrow night. No way! I won the lottery! Hey, cutie! Girl, please! My baby! Didn't you just whoop me? Hey, what's up, bro? Oh, now you don't want to punch me. Hey, I'm back with the milk. No, thanks. We already have milk. Oh, great heavens! 
Hold on, I'm coming. All right, what is it you want me to see? Watch this. I'm watching. <laughs> hey, don't do that. You're gonna hurt yourself. I'm fine, Mom. I've done this thousands of times. Today I was walking and I saw a news Look, van. I've always wanted to be on live TV. And the timing couldn't have been better. If I don't reach 20 million subscribers within this month, I have to get my biggest hater's name, Vesh Remy, tattooed on me. And advertising on live TV in front of millions of people is the perfect way to do so. But how am I going to do this? I got it! I quickly went home and made a sign and raced back to the news van. I crept up nervously and knew what I had to do. And now to see if I pulled it off. Reporting to you live. <gasps> Look, it's me! Bro, you're getting hundreds of subscribers a minute. What? Dude, let's go! Subscribe to help me get to 20 million. Hey, put your phone away. I'm already you done with the test. Let me see. Yeah, twice. you definitely failed this test. Whatever. Just for talking back, you have detention. Oh, why do you always pick on me? Let me tell you something. You, you will never make it in life. Ten years later. I am the only one. Oh my goodness, you played so good on that Netflix show. Can I have a picture with you? <laughs> no. What? Why? Remember, I'm Mr. You will never make it in life. Oh, great heavens! It's so hot outside. Yeah, I know. Oh, what the heck? Oh, what the Hey man, remember when we were younger and we used to always finish each other's sentences? Yeah, those were the good old days. Why do you ask? Well... I'm wondering if we could do that again. This is my boyfriend Zong and he always eats unhealthy. So today, I'm gonna trick him and make him eat vegetables. Oh, I'm out of snacks, I'm so hungry. Zong, I got you some food. What, I'm not eating vegetables? All right, Zong, I'll make you a deal. If you can eat half of these vegetables, I'll give you these chips. Dude, that's easy, deal. I'm gonna finish half of these in no time. Enjoy. Mm -hmm. Almost done. Mm -hmm. I ate so much and there's still half left. You're so close, just finish it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, I'm funny, dog. Good job, Zong. Do you still want these chips? No, I'm so full. Also, what's that wall behind you? Oh, if you guys subscribe, I'll write your name on this wall. Ooh. Today was the worst day of my life. This is a diamond play button that YouTube gives to creators for getting 10 million subscribers. I recently surpassed 10 million subscribers, but I still haven't received mine yet. Did YouTube forget to send it? I immediately called YouTube and they said they won't give me another one until I reach 20 million subscribers. Bruh. So I made a deal with my biggest hater, Vesh Remy. If I don't hit 20 million subscribers within the next 30 days, I will get his name tattooed on me. Subscribe to Topper Gill! Subscribe to Topper Gill! Oh, oh. Subscribe to Topper Gill! Goofa, you made the news! You made the news! Subscribe and get me to 20 million! Teacher, teacher! What's wrong? I think the world is ending! Is this one of your silly pranks? No, I'm being for real! The zombies are already here! Let them come! You're not scared? No, because we have them! Let's do this! Oh, no! My time to shine! Oh, great heavens! Perfect. Let's see how they turned out. What the heck? This is my boyfriend Zong, and he loves to eat pizza. So I'm gonna prank him with an upside down pizza! Here's your pizza, Zong! Thank you, baby! <gasps> what is this? Did you just buy pizza with no toppings on top? Uh, I'm 
I'm gonna call the manager right now. Wait, what? Yes. Hello? Is this Pizza Hut? I just bought pizza and there's no toppings on it. And I ordered the pepperoni one with extra pineapples. What? You're not giving me my money back? This is why I should have gone to Domino's. Wait, Zong, relax. The pizza's upside down. Wait, what? Wait, Zong, what's that wall behind you? Oh, if this is right, I'll write your name on the wall. Oh my God. What happened to it? In my last video, I surprised Arak with the world's largest pizza topper. And it was a massive success. Well, kind of. Bruh. Little did I know, my biggest hater, Vesh Remy, had a plan of his own. He grabbed the ladder, snuck up to the top of the pizza topper, and started to destroy my $50,000 surprise for Arak. He started by painting Vesh Remy across the entire thing. He then dumped red paint all over the custom Arak logo. And finally, he painted all the legs on the Bruh. pizza topper to ruin my masterpiece once and for all. Veshremi then fled the scene without a trace. After Arak finished his 140-foot pizza, he was thanking me again for my incredible effort and gift to him. But then we saw it. Oh my god! What happened to it? It's like a prank. No, no, I, dude. Yeah. I, no, 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 you have to take my... Dude, what happened? Please subscribe to make me feel better. Answer the question. Why me? I didn't even raise my hand. Well, answer the question. Like, why can't you pick him to answer? Because he's always quiet and doesn't disturb the class like you do. I'll be quiet if you ask him instead. Fine. What comes after C? Or. What comes after R? PG. What comes after A? K47. What comes after X? Explosion. Oh, great heavens! Everyone, run! Luke, go have a shower. Can I have one tomorrow? I'm watching TV. You didn't have one yesterday, so you probably stink, and it's getting close to your bedtime, so go have one right now. <sighs> Fine. Jeez, that was quick. Yeah, well, you know, I just needed to wash with soap and water down, and now I'm done. It's past your bedtime. Go to bed. Okay, good night. I want someone to love. If you love YouTube, I had the worst birthday ever. Ever since I was a kid, I've always wanted to rent out an entire theme park for my birthday. So the first thing I did was call Disneyland to see how much it would cost to rent the park for the entire day. That will be eight million. That wasn't happening. I did the next logical thing and tried to get a regular ticket, but everything was sold out. So I then did the next logical thing, which was calling up one of my friends who owns the theme park and begging him. And we got the yes. I invited all my friends and told them the great news about how much fun we were gonna have. As soon as I got to the amusement park, I couldn't believe my eyes. This place was huge. My friends had to be here any second. So I waited and still nobody showed up. I don't think anybody's coming, but I wasn't gonna let that ruin my day. So I went inside and went on every single ride and played every single game there. I was exhausted from my day at the theme park, so I decided to go back home. I was a bit sad that my friends didn't show up, but then I got to the Airbnb and saw this. Surprise! They all surprised me with my favorite cake. This ended up being the best birthday ever, instead of me thinking, Does anyone have any questions? Okay, since we have 10 minutes left and no one has any questions. Come on, you always have a question. I can't think of anything right now. We're gonna take a pop quiz. Oh, look, he might have a question. Who? I thought you were suspended. I'm back, and I do have a question. What is it? Who's Joe? Joe who? Joe Mama. Oh, great heavens! Uh, quiz is postponed. Thank you for saving us.
Why is it praying? It must be a nice bear. I always pray before I eat. Ah! This is my roommate Nick, and for the longest time, he's been wanting to get a pet. So today, I'm gonna surprise him with a pet. Nick! Oh, yeah? I know you've been wanting a pet for a really long time. Yeah. So I'm gonna get you one. What did he say? Oh. No way, really? Yes, but first, you have to clean my toilet. Oh, okay, I'll do anything. Nick, you're doing a good job. Thank you. Wait, wait, wait. Is that my toothbrush? No, it's actually my own. I'll do anything for this pet. Can I get the pet now? One last thing. What is it? You have to cook me food. Here's your food. A watermelon? Do you even want this pet? Don't worry, it's a special one. A yellow one? Oh, okay, come with me. I got your pet. Yo. All right, open your eyes. Where's the pet? It's right there. Spider. Oh, spider. <laughs> Wait, where are you going? I can't believe you did this to me, dude. I'm leaving. Wait, what? If everyone watching subscribes, I'll buy him a dog. Today, I'm gonna figure out how many licks it takes to finish a jawbreaker. Honestly, this took me weeks to work on. My tongue feels like it's about to fall off, but I wasn't going to give up. I've already found out the answers to some of the most commonly asked questions a human had. Like how many tablespoons it takes to fill a bathtub, how many Doritos it takes to fill a bathtub, and how many licks it takes to finish a lollipop. There is no way the jawbreaker is gonna defeat me. And after putting my tongue through absolute torture, it took me exactly 56,000. 1302. Subscribe if you love candy. No, son, you drove me crazy, but I still loved you. No, my sweet baby. It was because of that damn phone. Okay, let's go home. Later that night. I can't believe it. Who am I going to play with now? Me? No, get out of my room. Okay. I'm stuck. I don't know what to do. Did I hear you say stuck? I can help. Oh, great heavens. Feel like a mixtape catch on your crib if you bring this is too late. Ando na prancha Cuidado, tubarão vai te pegar Que é só tubara, enquanto tu tá... Who's that Pokemon? Oh! Oh! This is Pikachu! Oh, wrong! <laughs> what? Who's that Pokemon? Oh, is it Pikachu? Oh my god! <laughs> wrong! Dude, look! Who's, who's that, that Pokemon? Pokemon? Oh, yo, 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 yo! I got it this time! I got it this time! Yeah? It's Pikachu! <laughs> no? Is there other Pokemon than Pikachu? Okay, Zong, last chance. What Pokemon is this? You know what? I'm gonna change my answer. I'm gonna go with Charizard. Oh my god! Zong, this is what Pikachu looks like. Oh, can I have it? All right, if everyone watching subscribes, I'll buy it for you. Please, guys. So you guys saw that my biggest hater, Vesh Remy, ruined my car. And that had me thinking, I wonder what he actually looks like. So I called Vesh Remy and tried my top tier negotiating skills. I will pay you $100 to take off your mask and reveal your face to the world. $100, bro? I want my butt with that. Bro. But he wasn't budging. So I gave him an offer he couldn't resist. $10,000. Fine, bro. Bye. I grabbed my wallet and went to go meet up with him. You got the money, goofball? You got the face, Vesh Remy? You had the whole car ride and that's all you could come up with? And it was finally time to see what this guy really looks like. All right, man. What are, what are you doing? Take off the mask so I can see your face. What do you mean? You said take off your mask. Bro, bro come on. That's unfair. All right, bro. I took off my mask. You gave me the money, so bye-bye. Dude, that's not fair. Subscribe if I should try again. Mom, can I stay in today? I'm not feeling too good. Okay, sure, honey. The next day. What's up? Bro, where were you yesterday? I just didn't feel like coming to school. Bro, you missed out. What happened? We went to Six Flags. What? You're kidding. There was like 20 fights yesterday. Are you serious? Mr. Beast came to our school and gave us $1,000 each. Dang it, I could have bought two PS5s. Oh yeah, and he gave us all PS5s. Oh, great heavens! How much would you sell your horse for? I'd sell it to you for $2,000. 2000 Deal. Perfect. You can come and pick him up tomorrow. Hey, I'm here to pick up the horse. I have some bad news. Unfortunately, the horse passed away. You know what, it's fine. Just give me my money back. I can't do that. I already spent it all. Okay, then give me the dead horse. Why? What are you gonna do with it? I'm gonna raffle it off. You can't raffle off a dead horse. Of course I can. I just won't tell anyone that it's dead. Hey man, what happened to the dead horse? Did you end up raffling it off? <laughs> I sure did. I sold 500 tickets for $25 each and made a total of 25,000. Did anyone complain? Just the guy that won. So I gave him his money back. <gasps> oh, I found it. Yay! No! Here's my phone. Thank you. Oh. Say goodbye to your phone. No, no. My phone. How can you do this to my 
my phone! Oh! Chicken? <gasps> yeah! Oh, are you serious? Here's my chicken cat! Yeah! Ooh! Wait, it's fake! Hey, where are you going? Oh! T-shirt? What? The cat is a jacket! Oh, let's go! Time to destroy cat's favorite jacket! <laughs> Rate her new jacket once a ten! Uh -huh. Oh! Pool! Yeah. No! You have to jump in the pool so dark! If you do, everyone watching will subscribe! Here we go! Let's go! Oh, guys, go subscribe! Today I found a sign for a missing dog named Nibbles with a $50,000 reward. And I had to do whatever it would take to get the 50, Bruh. I mean return the dog to its rightful owner. So I went to the first place a dog would run away to, the dog toy store. But Nibbles was nowhere to be seen. I then realized I was moving too slow and headed to his last known location, the dog park. Upon arriving, I realized this was going to be much harder than I had expected. I made a few trips around the park and carefully observed each dog, but still no Nibbles. I was starting to give up until I found this. A note with Nibbles' name on it, on the back of a Dobrik's pizza receipt. So I went to Dobrik's and found... Another dog that wasn't Nibbles. I was getting discouraged, but wasn't ready to give up. Until I received a notification that Nibbles was found three years ago, and I wasted my entire day. Bruh. Subscribe if you love dogs. Well, well, well. What, are you surprised to see me? No. I skipped school for this moment. No one's here, which means no one's gonna help you. I'm hungry. I forgot to take the meat out. Daddy. You can yell all you want, but no one's coming. Hey, sweetie, did you say you were hungry? Don't tell me you forgot to take the meat out again. I'm here. But I said daddy. Whatever, can you get him? I mean, he's not my type, but I'll do it for you. Oh, great heavens. Mommy. All right, I'm headed to the spa for the day, so I'll see you two later tonight. Drive safe, dear. Bye, Mom. It's looking like it's going to be hot and sunny out today, which is perfect because this morning at 8 a.m., the yearly theme park opened. And if you remember from previous years, it's only open one day of the year. So stop by at any time today and have some fun. Dad, can we go to that? Mm, maybe in a bit, but don't bother me about it or we won't be going, okay? Okay. So, did you guys do anything fun today? No. Oh yeah, did you want to go to that theme park today? Why didn't you remind me? I would have taken you. Stop, Stop playing! playing! Why? Can we go out, please? No, I'm busy building my house, can't you see? Aww. Since Song didn't want to go out with me, I'm going to trick him. Song, I need your help! Wait, what? There's a dog stuck in a tree outside. Really? Yeah, come on, hurry, okay, hurry, okay, hurry. Okay. Cat, where's the dog? Behind you. Hello. Cat, are you serious? Yeah, the dog is stuck in the tree. Dude, I'm going back inside. Song, there's money growing on trees outside. Cat, stop lying to me and leave me alone. So you don't want it? No! <laughs> You're lost. Okay. See, I told you it was real. Well, how? That's what you get for not going out with me. Subscribe and I'll go out with Cat. So last video, I pranked my biggest hater, Vesh Remy. He was so mad that he said this. Sleep with one eye open, Topper. So that's exactly what I've been doing. I woke up extremely tired because it's super difficult to sleep this way. So I went to go get a coffee and my car was gone. So I asked the only person who knew where I kept the spare key to my car. I gave the car to Vesh Remy because he gave me a ticket to Disneyland. I couldn't believe it. I've been betrayed. So I called Vesh Remy. Where's my car? Dude, meet me at this address in 10 seconds or you're done for. And he told me exactly where to meet him if I wanted my car back. Go, 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 what you doing my car? I'm texting a model right now. I don't care who you're texting, why is there a blanket on my car? Enjoy your new car. I heart Vesh Remy. It's permanent, bro. This is your fault. You never took me to Disneyland. You haven't even seen the best part. <laughs> you like it? Is that your profile picture on my car? You destroyed my car. You destroyed my Lambo. All right, here's your car, bro. Your mom, I mean, my Uber is waiting. Bro. Subscribe if I should get revenge. Hey, mom, I have a question. What's up? How come dad only works one job and you have to work so many? What are you talking about? I don't have a job at the moment. Don't lie, mom. I was going through your closet and saw three uniforms. I didn't even know you worked at. What uniforms? A maid outfit? Like, I didn't know you were a maid. A nurse outfit? Like, you didn't even help me when I was sick last week. A cop outfit with handcuffs? Like, I didn't know you catch bad guys. Yeah, I can do many things. I'm gonna ask my friends if they need a maid. Oh, great heavens! Your last birthday card here is from Grandma. Thank you so much, Grandma. Why don't I put that money in a safe spot so you don't lose it? Okay, good idea. Mom, 
Mom, do you know where Dad is? I'm pretty sure he's outside in the garage. Okay, thank you. Hey, Dad, where did you put my money? What am I doing? Eh, not much. I just picked up this brand new tool today, so I'm just in the garage testing it out. Let's see what we got here! Ooh, McDonald's! Let's go! Ooh, McDonald's! Ha, oh. what are you doing? Hey. NJ burrito. Oh, burrito. Wait, what are you doing? Do you just buy from the side? You're so weird, cat. <laughs> Enjoy, cat. Ooh, ramen. Ooh, wait, why is it green? What? Oh, look, it's Hello Kitty. Mm, yummy. And if you subscribe, I'll write your name on this wall. Subscribe. This is how I was forced to buy my biggest hater, Vesh Remy, a Lamborghini. A couple weeks ago, he asked me this. Can I get a Lambo? And originally I said no. But then I left a comment saying if I reached 11 million subscribers by the end of 2022, I would get him one. That kinda happened. So I reached out to him, and here's what happened. Are you Vesh Remy? No, I'm your DoorDash, you goofball. Yep. It's him. Bro, right. I was thinking this car. Do you want to like test drive it? Like, what do you want to do? There's just one problem, bro. I don't know how to drive. I couldn't let him make his decision without taking it for a spin. It was now time to make it official. And the Lamborghini was his. Wait, Topper, how am I supposed to get this home? I'll show you. What is this? At least you said it was going to be brown. I thought of that. What the? Here you go. That's how Topper wants to play it. Sleep with one eye open, Topper. Subscribe if you want a Lambo. Honey, look what I got for our son. What? No way, a PS5? Hold on, let me get my camera out. But I got this for our son. I know, I just want to record you giving it to him. I don't think you understand. I got this for our son. Oh, great heavens! Oh, uh... Who made this mark on the wall? That was Luke, it wasn't me. No, it wasn't me. What are you talking about? Luke, tell me the truth. I am telling the truth. Why would you blame me for ruining a wall in Jimmy's bedroom when I never go in there? It's true, Mom. He hasn't been in my room today. What? So you're saying you did it? No, Luke still did it. That's what I thought. So, how do you put a giraffe in a refrigerator? Um, you open the refrigerator and then you put the giraffe inside. Ooh, correct. Okay, okay, okay. How do you put an elephant in a refrigerator? Um, that is easy. You open the refrigerator and then you take the giraffe out and you put the elephant inside. Ooh, correct. Okay, okay, okay. The Lion King is hosting an animal party and all animals are invited except one didn't go. Which animal is it? Um, oh, the elephant didn't go because it's stuck in the refrigerator. Correct! Ooh. Okay, last one. There's a river you must cross, but crocodiles live there. How do you cross it? Um, you don't cross it. Uh, Wait, why? You can just swim because all the crocodiles are at the party. Wait, what? Subscribe if you got the riddle correct. I didn't. So as I was about to shower today, I remembered something. I'm more of a bath type of guy. And that got me thinking. It takes 5,437 Doritos to fill a bathtub. I wonder how many tablespoons of water it takes. I got right to work. And let me tell you, this was taking way longer than I expected. And then it hit me. The drain was opened. So back to square one. After doing this nonstop for what felt like a lifetime. Well, except for that one break. <sighs> I was exhausted, but so close. So I pushed myself and found out it takes exactly 26,352. Subscribe if you love baths. Yo, Dad, look at this picture. What is it? It's a funny meme. Dad, what are you doing? I'm just looking through your photos. No, stop. That's one of the things you do that frustrate me. What's the other things? Leaving my door open when you leave my room. Get mad when I touch the thermostat like I'm not a little boy. When you leave to get the milk and I don't see you for months? He did it again! Don't worry about him, I'm your real dad. Oh, great heaven! How can I help you guys today? Hi, my wife and I are looking for a vehicle that'll fit us and our three kids. Hmm, I think I have the perfect one in mind. Follow me. Alright. So this truck right here will fit a whole family without any problems. Oh, what's wrong? Well, it won't work for us then. Why not? Because our family has lots of problems. Oh, it's so hot! I need water! 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 
Ah, oh, refreshing. Ah, oh, my phone is stuck. Oh, wait. Oh, my phone is stuck. Wait, here we go. I'll write your name on the wall. Today, I'm going to be trying Disneyland's secret foods that nobody knows about. So for this first one, you have to ask for the Galaxy Swirl in Star Wars Land. This wasn't even on the menu. Let's try it out. Oh my god. What was that? This is amazing though. And then in Downtown Disney, I asked for... Can I please do one mystical Mickey? Oh my gosh. How is this possible? And it was the coolest drink ever. Now for the weirdest food I ever tasted. Can I please get one of the pickled corn dogs? And check this out. Dude, there's literally a pickle inside. I'm taking five subscribers to Disneyland, so subscribe. <laughs> hey, put your phone away. Oh, my best friend just passed away. It doesn't matter, put the phone I'm home from work. Oh, it's my dad. Oh, how's my little boy doing? What's he doing with his hands on his face? I've never seen him do that one before. <gasps> what the heck? Did, did he just disappear? Spigaboo! <laughs> okay, that was a good one. Oh, a uh, soda explosion? Wait, what? Ooh. Here we go. Oh. Yo. Woo. Oh, uh, is it is it pancakes? Let's go. Ooh, I wanted that one. What? How is the pancake blue, guys? That doesn't make any sense. Oh, a uh, Burger Queen? Oh, what? What? Dude, it's Burger King. Come oh, on. Oh, man. Wait, I'm on a diet. Don't worry. I got you a Diet Coke. Oh. Mm. Dude, this is so good. No, it's not. McDonald's is better. Guys, comment down below if you prefer McDonald's or Burger King. Uh, the spider run? <laughs> what? Come on, it's Spider-Man. Aww. Oh, Spider-Man is so fun. Don't forget to eat your edible bugs. What? Dude, I'm not eating the bugs. If you eat it, everyone watching will subscribe. Okay. Here we go, guys. Oh, oh my God. Uh, Today I got the best news of my life. Free Subway for life, it'll cost you a 12 by 12 inch tattoo of a foot long thug. So I did the obvious. I called a professional body paint artist and was given very specific instructions to pull this off. Number one, shave your chest. Number two, pay me a thousand dollars. After both of these were complete and the sandwich was on my stomach, it was go time. Okay, so I heard online that if you have a Subway sandwich tattoo, that you get free Subway. Oh my gosh, dude, no way! Subscribe if you love Subway. What's up, are you new here? Yeah, I was gonna ask if there's any cool friend groups I can join. Well, it depends how cool you are, but there's an elite friend group that's coming right now. Um, why he wink at me? Oh, he's just super sus. Oh. Oh, great heavens! Luke, what does IDK and IDC mean? I don't know, and I don't care. Excuse me? Also, Mom, what's for dinner? I don't know, and I don't care. This is my boyfriend, Song. All he does is play video games, and he never does his homework, so I'm gonna trick him. Song, how much for the slime? Um, nine dollars. Okay, here's three dollars. Okay. And another three dollars? Um, that's not enough. Yeah, it is. See for yourself. Okay. Three plus three equals <gasps> nine? What? You were right. See, I told you. Thank you for the slime. What? How? Starbucks always gets people's names wrong. So today we're putting that to the test. I went into the Starbucks and the worker asked me this. Perfect. What's your name? Topper. As I waited for my drink, I thought there was no way they were going to spell my name wrong. Timmy? Like Timmy Neutron? I thought maybe it was just this location. So I tried another Starbucks. This time giving them a name, they couldn't possibly mess up. Yes, Eric? E-R-I-C. Eric? Like the YouTuber? Uh. This has to be some sort of joke. I started to lose hope standing outside my third Starbucks. But this time, I got an idea. I was gonna give them the hardest name I could possibly think of. Joaquin? Make sure to drop a like because we're gonna need all the luck we can get. And now for the moment of truth. 
They spelled it right. Subscribe if you love Starbucks. Mom, can I go to my friend's house today? No. Why? Because I said so. But mom, that's not a valid reason. Don't talk back to me. Oh, the things you say frustrate me. Like what? When you call me for nothing, like the remote's right there. When you say, just pause it, like I can't pause an online game. Oh, and don't forget when you blame everything on my phone. You probably got all this info from that phone. Oh, great heavens! You see? <laughs> Is everything okay? I had a really scary dream, and now my stomach hurts. What was it about? It was about me eating a really large marshmallow. A large marshmallow? <gasps> Luke, where's your pillow? Boyfriend Zong and he loves expensive water and he never drinks cheap water. So today I'm gonna trick him. I'm gonna tell him that one of these waters is cheap and one of them is expensive, but it's actually the same cheap water. Let's go! All right, Zong, if you can guess which water is cheap and which one is expensive, I'll give you a thousand dollars. But if you don't, you have to jump in the pool. There's two easy deal. All right, first one. Ah, this one's cheap. It tastes like top water. Okay. All right, second one. Oh. Oh, this one is fancy. This one's an expensive one. Am I correct? Actually, Zong, they're both cheap water. What? Do I really have to jump in the pool with all my coats on? Yep, and if you do, everyone watching will subscribe. Okay. <gasps> Go subscribe. Recently, Santa left me a note saying that if everybody who watched this video liked and subscribed, I would be off his naughty list. But this didn't happen. So, I had to take matters into my own hands. I booked my flight, packed my bags, and was off to the North Pole to find Santa and ask him to take me off the naughty list myself. Once I landed, I searched everywhere for Santa. I was starting to give up. But then, I found some massive footprints. <laughs> They led me to this tree with another present from Santa under it. I quickly opened it and the note read, Dear Topper, I admire your courage and determination to get back on my nice list. But unfortunately, that will only happen if you reach 12 million subscribers. Subscribe! All this time, she was standing there, she never took her eyes off me. Yo, what is your problem? Tell me what's the problem.